Today on our 2016 GMC Canyon, we're test fitting the Strongberg Carlson 23x60 cargo carrier. Now they've designed this for use with two inch hitches and it offers a 500 pound weight capacity. The part number on it is CC-100. Now as you can see, we've got a nice large expanded steel floor here on the carrier. Allows that dirt, debris, even medium sized rocks to fall right down and through so we're not gonna have to worry about them building up on the carrier. There's going to be a raised edge that comes all the way around the outside here. It's about two and three quarters of an inch high, so for the smaller frame cargo carriers, that's about a quarter inch higher than we see with most of them. I also like the fact that we've got pre-drilled holes that are going to go all the way around here. It's going to be a total of 12 of them. That's going to help us get our items secured once we've got them in place. Now as far as ground clearance goes, it's like we've got about 16 inches here at the back. Overall, our carrier is going to add about 27 and 3 quarters of an inch to the back of the canyon. And at its closest point there, before it make contact with the rear of the truck, we're going to be about 4 and a quarter inches away. Now one big benefit I think that, that stands out about this carrier is that we've got a very low profile here. It's about six inches in total width, so we often store these in the garage or down in the basement. It's not going to take up a whole lot of space. If we tuck it up against the wall, it's only going to stick out about six inches, which I think is really nice. You see as we open the tailgate here on the canyon, it does overhang the carrier. It's going to overhang it by about 12 and a quarter inches, but it seems to be one of the higher ones that we've seen as far as clearance here. That's gonna be about 10 and 3 quarters of an inch. So if you're gonna be stacking items up higher than that, just keep an eye on your tailgate when you lower it because it's likely to make contact. Now the carrier we've got secured now using part number PC3, just a standard pin and clip. You can see it's gonna have some movement and some play as you head down the highway. It's like any other cargo carrier out there in the market secured with a pin and a clip. The shank is hollow, so that's gonna allow for an anti-rattle device to be put in there. If you really wanna secure it up and keep it from moving around, we've got plenty of those available on our website. The exhaust on the Canyon, it comes straight out this direction. It's designed as a passenger, kind of a rear passenger outlet there. So I don't think you're going to have any issues with heat sensitive materials and getting those stacked up there. Now that we've had a good look at the Strongberg Carlson cargo carrier and we've seen how it's going to fit on our 2016 GMC Canyon, let's take a look and see how that carrier performed when they had it out on our test course. Here it is on our test course. We'll start by going through the slalom. This is going to show us the side-to-side -side action, which simulates turning corners or evasive maneuvers. Next, we're at the alternating speed bumps, which we'll see the twisting action. This will simulate hitting a curb or pothole or driving over uneven pavement. Finally, we have the full speed bumps, where we'll see the up and down action, which is just like driving out of a parking lot, garage, or driveway.